lovely people of the world how have you been it's been a long time but today i am churning out video after video after video after video so uh, <clears throat> you might see uh the look uh, that looks very very familiar this time around i was not expecting these i went into aldi for a different reason altogether but i found some uh, shadow palettes and i thought wait a minute wait a minute those look a bit familiar don't they uh dupes or abh palettes and uh, well abh 45 pounds was it 40 43 pounds i believe um and then these ones are five pounds 99 massive difference in price but are they any good i mean are you going to put these on your eyes and think oh reaction or oh crap uh, so i am comparing these today excuse me <laughs> excuse me okay Yeah, it's looking manky. It's looking messy. I, I, it, it's the time the palette that it is. That's what happens. But this is uh, the original, and this is the eyeshadow palette from Lacura. As you can see, this one is Desert Rain. Lacura Desert Rain. Um, material is meant to be fairly similar. However, this one feels a lot softer. Uh, size wise, they are. Oh my God! Don't drop it! Don't drop it! Don't drop it! <laughs> my God! Size wise, um. ABH is just a tiny bit smaller. It's not, it's more just about this one being slightly longer, but really it's not much of a difference. And this is what the back looks like for each one. I was again, I am so sorry about the quality of the, <clears throat> the look of this. And if you guys can see, I have hit pan on so many in this palette. I love this soft glam palette. It is so good. Right, so they do really look similar. Except I can see I'm looking at it and I'm thinking, mm, the colours, these ones are much, look more intense, they look a lot warmer. But we shall see how they apply, whether they're exactly the same. I'm going to keep the looks um, very, very simple. This eye, I'm going to use the um, Nakura one and this, this eye, I'm going to use the ABH one. I really shouldn't be touching my eyes. I had an eye um, treatment for my lashes and that. <clears throat> cross fingers um so i am going to go with um each each by the way each one of these has got names but the names do not correspond uh similar to the um, abh one because i think that'll be taking it too far um and as you can see i'm going to start off with um sienna this one here and i'm going to go with the matching sh corresponding shade at the bottom which for this one is going to be red rock and then from sienna i'm going to move on to mulberry in the corner over there and i'm going to use it the corresponding one which is um badlands and uh, this one here um and then i'm going to go for something on my eyes i'm thinking i'm going to go for haze which is uh, the original one is sultry um but maybe maybe i'll go for the rose pink instead but corresponding shade is cactus uh, flower so there you go that's cactus flower and that's haze just in case i didn't show it properly corresponding shades are at the very top here um but yeah so that's what we're gonna go for um we shall see <laughs> don't know if this is any good on my eyes i've already got the eye base on p louise um eye base rumor number eight uh i've already already got um foundation in place as well starting off with abh let's go sienna I, I don't really need to say much about abh it is what it is i love it pigmented uh easy to blend blah 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 so i'm gonna whiz through the abh eye look um and then we're just gonna really concentrate on the uh, lacura one to see what it's like so here we go No complaints, as you guys know, super easy to blend and so on. So I'm going to go into corresponding shade, which is Red Rock. There's a bit, ooh, 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 oh, okay. There's quite a bit of pigment. <gasps> okay, that was one dab. And there's a bit of fallout, very similar to ABH. Um, you can see here with just one dab, the effect is had. Come on, come on, there you go. There's a bit of fallout. So hopefully we'll be able to get the color payoff. I'm just going to dab in there again a couple of times. And let's see how similar it is to the ABH. Ooh. Oh. 
Oh, oh. Oh. Uh, okay. Uh, wow. Wow. Okay. That's not bad. I'm not too sure how this shows on camera. The color is fairly close. There's just a sm slight smidgen of um, smidgen of a difference, but and it needs more build up. But look at that. Oh. Oh, Aldi Lacoro, you're taking a mick. <gasps> it doesn't feel patchy. It blends really easy. Can you look? Oh, oh. No, it's, it's, you're taking a mick. <gasps> oh, Lacoro, oh my God. God, that is not right. That's just not right. I'm just going to dip in again. Not that I need to, but I just want to make sure that everything is exactly the same. So, yeah, with this one, with the ABH, clearly there's more intensity, more pigment. But with uh, the Aldi uh, one, you need to go back in a bit more to build up the color. But honestly, We're going to whiz through ABH Mulberry. I'm just going to concentrate that on the outer corner of the eye. Um, and then we're going to try. I can't. Uh, uh, wow. I've checked it in daylight. Honestly, they look exactly the same. Whoa. Right. So let's just going to just going to whiz through this one. time for <clears throat> badlands let's try this one out um and i'm using actually uh the zoeva um soft definer brush but i'm just packing it on the outer corner and i use a similar brush but uh to the other one uh, on the other side um oh right so this one has got slightly less fallout but i'm tapping it in and it's bringing up a lot of pigment Just make sure my camera can focus. See that? Let's see. Let's see. Ooh. Let's see. <gasps> Shut the front door on your way out. Get out of here. Oh, <gasps> no. No, you are having a laugh. Oh, <gasps> no way, no way. It deepens, as I said before, with the other colour. You need to build it up. You need probably need to go in about three times to get the same level of intensity as you would from the Soft Glam palette. But honestly, £5.99, 40 odd quid. <gasps> no. I'm going to move on to the next shade. The shimmer this time around, I'm going to use a brush to see how it applies with the brush. And I'm going to go with uh, Rose Pink from the Anastasia Beverly Hills. You see that? Oh. The pigment is, oh, wow. And a shade Cactus Flower. Don't let me down. Don't let me down. So I'm using the brush. Okay, you don't pick up as much with the brush when it comes to shimmer. You have to go back in several times. What? What? <gasps> no. No way. What?
Wow. All right, so I'm nearly done. I'm gonna go and finish off the rest of my face off camera. Underneath each eye, I'm gonna put the corresponding colors, um, Mulberry on this side at the bottom, and then Badlands on this eye at the bottom. Um, and then I'll do some swatches, and then we'll, um, I'll give you my final thoughts. So back in a mo. Okay, people, so this is the finished look. And as you can see, this side is lighter than this side. Uh, but the mattes themselves are very, very, very similar. It's the shimmers uh, that differ a little bit. The formula differs again slightly in that the uh, um, the soft my palette is much softer. The, the shimmers are really nice. And I know the fact that they work really well using the finger as well. I think that with the, uh, <clears throat> let's get it right, Desert Rain um, eyeshadow palette, your, I mean, it works really well clearly with uh, a brush, but it will work better probably with uh, using your finger as well, putting a little bit of pressure and then dragging it along, you'll be able to get more color payoff. I didn't want to get more color payoff because I could tell already that the shade was slightly lighter and I didn't want it to be too, too different. Um, so yeah, so I'm just gonna quickly go through some, um, just do the shimmers. Uh, because the mats are very very close to uh, close um, you know I'm gonna take my watch off so I've got a little bit more room um, by the way I am rubbish and I'm, I'm feeling really cold at the moment so I'm really rubbish at doing uh, swatches so I'm gonna go with what's originally glistening in um, in a soft my palette and I'm just gonna apply that and as you can see, oh, I did say I'm not the best at doing, you know, swatches. I'll go for the corresponding shade, which is Oasis. And that's right there. You can see there is a difference. Oasis, uh, Oasis is much brighter. This one is much more muted. Uh, let's see if that's the same with the next shade. Um, we've got Cactus Flower, so we've already got done that. So I'm going to go with Haze and Sultry. Um, so this is Sultry, which is a little bit dark, unfortunately, because I touched it with another shade. So there you go. So that's that one. And then the corresponding um, shade is Haze. And you can see so I see a theme here and I'm just gonna go with another two shades so we're gonna go for bronze and ooh, make sure I don't get it right there you go so bronze and corresponding one is Sphinx That's not too bad, that's fairly close, I think. Although it's slightly brighter, but it's fairly close. I'm sorry that my uh, swatches are rubbish, um, but I'm gonna go with the final shade, which is Fairy, in the original. Whew. And the corresponding one shade is Mirage. Uh, oh, so that's it. Mirage. <laughs> yeah, right. Whatever. Um, and excuse the nail. And that is Mirage. Ooh. Ooh. Look. I mean, horrible swatches. Uh, or but. Okay. So I would say this one. Your um, the mat. Need a bit more work, need to build them up, but you get color intensity. Um, the shimmers, um, they're a lot brighter in this, uh, in this, uh, <clears throat> the dupe, um, and they're a bit more muted in uh, the uh, Anastasia Beverly Hills. 
Um, but honestly, I mean, listen, these people have gone, Lakura and Aldi have gone so far as to even create the rubbish, you know, the crappy brushes that, that uh, Anastasia Beverly Hills always includes. They've also included that. I mean, talk about duping a, a, a national palette. But if you've never bought the Anastasia Beverly Hills and you want a dupe and you want something that's uh, cheap, um, then actually I can't really say no to this palette. It is shocking, really. It's performed really well. Um, and for the price difference, oh my God, that's what, 20, 28 pounds? 28, what am I talking about, 28 pounds? Uh, listen, at least 30 pounds difference, it, that is a huge, huge saving. So yes, I would, or even not, although I feel a bit bad recommending a dupe, uh, which makes me feel a little bit guilty, uh, it is a damn good uh, dupe. Honestly, I, <laughs> hands down. So those are my final thoughts. Thank you, people. Let me know what you guys think about this. Um, and will you be popping out there to get yourself some uh, or not? They've got another, as I said, there's another one here. Uh, there was a third one as well. I've forgotten um, what it matches up to, what, they, what it, um, it is the dupe of. Uh, but there you go. So do what you want with your money. People, stay safe wherever you are. Thank you for watching and uh, you guys will see you.